Mm. Hello and welcome to another episode of Persona 5 Royal. It's time to continue. What we're going to do, well, we've got 17 days of free time. But we can do whatever the hell we want. Uh, so we can level up for Yuji, we can level up for Utaba, which I don't think I've got enough kindness for yet. Um, let's check. But I'm just going to turn my screen a little bit more towards me. Alright, social stats. Uh, selfless, so I can do, I can do Futaba. Um, but you know what, I'm gonna do Ryuji. I'm gonna get Ryuji, uh, out of the way. Actually, you know what, now I should hang up with Miruki. Get Miruki's, uh, friendship a little higher. Futaba has some amazing skills now. I guess I'll have to focus on Futaba when I get a chance. Uh, I should probably do shit with him to get his level up. And then hang out with other people on the weekend. Okay. Also, Jazz Club with Futaba gets new skills. Sweet. Ruki also some amazing abilities. I'll have to start inviting people out to the Jazz Club. I've not really used the Jazz Club too much. But I can definitely see me using the Jazz Club more in my second playthrough. Because I won't have to do everyone's confidence, because I'm going to try and max out nearly everyone, everybody's confidence. So I won't have to focus as much time in maxing out some confidence. I'm gonna have to definitely do some because um, I haven't done uh, a couple of them. Who needs police when we have the Phantom Thieves? So true. Such much, so much for great being a great detective. A catchy kind is finished. I'm really curious about their true identities. There's calling card posters of collectors items now. It's gonna be a bit quiet because it's 3 a.m. That's why I'm suppressing my amazing voice acting. Hey. Well then. Nice. Hey. Fuck me, uh, Yusuke. Uh, Yusuke. Why, why do I keep saying Yusuke? I think mean, it's because I've been like so focused and trying to learn the pronunciation for uh, for Yusuke in Persona 4 that I keep saying Yusuke instead of Yusuke. 925 gives concentrate. Uh, well, you got to go there in the evening, don't you? you? Can't go there during the day. Can we do darts and billiards? Billiards during the day. Yep, as in I can't go to the jazz club during the day. Or yep, as in I can do. Or yep, as in you agree that you're. Uh. <laughs> Welcome. What do you play? Uh, billards. Okay, so I should be b b uh, billiards then. Did I do darts or billiards? I think I've already done darts, so I think I should focus on billiards. Yeah, so billiards just technical, right? And that's what I'm wanting. What do you want to do? Thank you. Yeah, no, I need to get I need to get people ranked up. Whoa! Well, I can't wait to play. Let's get started already. <laughs> the sound on the ball scat is so satisfying. The way the balls are positioned, I'll need to make a difficult shot to clear this. Huh? What were you going for that Thanks. shot? Nice. Good going. This, the behind the back shot Beautiful. trick worked. Looked great. Are you going to put concentrate on? Uh, prob probably uh, Joker Maybe or on. Who actually pulled that shot? And this is why you're our leader. Looks like your challenge brought everyone together. Oh. Nice work. My hands are all sweaty now. Glad to say everyone had fun. I gotta say now. Thanks for playing Billiards, it looks like you've gotten better at analysing situations. Hmm. Didn't you uh, buy your own cue before? Looks like you didn't get to use it today. Did I buy my own pool cue? Well, you can't walk the path of Billiards in one day, so let's come again another time. That was so much fun! Alright then. On, can't get concentrate already, and you can't put it on Joker. Oh. Hmm. Ah, your 
back. I, don't know. I don't know who I'd put it on. That creep hasn't tried anything funny, right, Haru? No, I'm okay. Thanks for asking, Anchan. Father did say he'd uh, rescind the marriage offer as well. Okay, so it's just deadline stuff that we don't really need to talk about. Alright. Well then. Uh, so who should I put concentrate on then if I do go to the uh, the jazz club? Hmm. Makoto is the best choice. The thing is, is I can't put it on a on myself. I guess Makoto would be best choice. Be a severe nuke, yeah. What do you want to do? Invite someone. Hey. Makoto. Oh. Hmm. Hey. Thanks for coming in. You can sit down then when it's open. You think you know about places like this too? It's simply amazing. Uh, I suppose it would be rude for me to look around when there's so many people here. This drink. This is good. Are these kind of drinks and the cocktails the adults drink? You're right. I tend to handle most of the general housework at home, and I realize the way I go about it very in a very particular way, especially cleaning. When I pointed out that window was dusty, sis said I was like a mother-in-law. I chatted with Makota for a while. I feel a little more mature. It's gotten so late. I was nervous at first, but it feels very home homely here. I feel like talking with you helped me remember my original resolve. Thank you. It was like spending time in the jazz club as has an effect on Makoto's heart. Concentrate. Oh god, what do I put on? Probably over flash bomb. Or maybe even the Kunda, because I don't really use the Kunda. Hmm. Probably the Kunda, because I never use it. Yeah, the Kunda. Thank you. Thanks for inviting me today. It was really fun. I'll look at the time. We should get going. All right then. Emiono, thank you so much. Uh, what are you talking about? I'm sorry, I'm just so happy. I just uh, got out of a meet and I was talking to you about, um, I was talking to you about, and my routine was the best I've ever given so far. But I just wanted to thank you for that. Why me? You're the only reason I've come so far, Senpai. You've helped me so much with such mundane things. I just can't help uh, thank you enough. Uh, please, I just want to thank you again. As soon as I get the results, I'll let you know. But I'll be messaging you again sometime soon. Now I'd better get going. Have a good night. palace is gone, so I guess we're waiting for a while. What do you guys do at times like this? Take a break. I see. I, see. I suppose it would uh, do us some good to do uh, to go easy now and again. So don't go overboard. You can't forget your primary duties as a high schooler. It's important to play in the role of a diligent student, right? Oh, Erica, you actually uh, did raid me. Wow. Okay. Uh, hey, everyone. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. This is uh, this is Persona 5 Royal. It is possibly in the best game ever made. Possibly. But hello and welcome. Uh, let's find somewhere to go. Something to do. Oh, no, we can level up Maruki. Let's hang out with Maruki then. Uh, 
uh, practice bottom. Uh, hello, RJ. Uh, hello, Erica. Hey, Gig. Hope you're doing all. Hope you're all doing well. Welcome. Uh, let's hang out with this guy. Okay. Thanks. You're just in time for some awful voice acting. Well, shall we begin? Well, let's get started for today. For today's topic, uh, let's see. I'd like to hear your opinion on these phantom thieves of hearts. The ones who steal the desires of criminals and reportedly force them to confess. Maybe it's been a little hard to believe, but I guess I've taken an academic interest in them. Thank you, uh, Glody, uh, for their follow. Um, you really are dedicated. <sighs> I don't know about that. It's just a gut feeling I have. But I get the feeling the Phantom Thieves' work and my own research are rooted in the same principles. That's why I've decided to analyse them from my own perspective. For example, there's no matter of their methods. According to these calling cards they send out, their stated method is to steal your desires. How is such a feat even possible? Never not bad. Any ideas? Uh, I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. Um... As in removing them? And removing them. As if there's something material rather than abstract. So they'd be stealing desires by taking some tangible form from of them. Well that's the if that's that has had I mean that's what you're gonna get used to when you see me stream is I fumble my words a lot. A lot. I suppose it'd be possible if uh, if you could find some physical proxy for a human's desires. Say. To me, Anoko, do you remember the story with the cookies? In that experiment, the desire for the cookies actually changed the way people tasted them. I think we can look at this in the same way. They're not something, e it, they're not something easily perceived, but desires have a tremendous effect on our cognition. Put another way, if that desire is gone, your cognitive uh, prep, uh, perception of the cookies skews back to normal. So, does that remind you of anything? The change of heart? Right. That's right. The Phantom Thieves' own change of heart. That's the basis of my theory. Now, Thief of Desire is not metaphor metaphorical, but something more direct. We still don't know exactly how they steal these desires, of course. But if the idea of a physical, tangible, if the idea of physical, tangible desires can be actualized, I think it'd be logically, I think it'd logically follow in the way that it can be taken away. In a world of intangibility, uh, intangibles. Uh, let's say a world composed of con of the contents of the human people. <sighs> oh, the drama chat. Can you believe? See, that's why Tubby bullies you, Cody. Uh, if they perceive the world like that, they could steal desires like any other treasure. Hey, Simbiono, you think I'm getting anywhere here? It's intriguing. You think so too? It's actually anywhere, is it, if it's actually anywhere close to the truth, it'd be incredible. Then again, we'd probably never know for sure unless we could ask one of the Phantom Thieves themselves. Hmm, I feel like I can construct a solid hypothesis now. It feels like I'm just one step away from finishing this paper. Thank you. Thank you, Simeona. I feel Maruki's heartfelt gratitude to me. Uh, so wait, am I the only one who stayed for the raid? I don't know. I've got six viewers, I just, I don't know if anyone's, people could just be watching or doing their own stuff. They don't necessarily have to be talking. Now today's mental training technique, how about something like this? Thanks for Maruki's mental training, my mind feels stronger. All right. Max SP is increased by five. Oh and here, never a bad time for a snack. Well, see you. I hope we can talk again sometime. It really is just the, like, the only control of my hands sweating. Is the PS4 controller, Xbox controller, my hands don't sweat, mouse and keyboard, my hands don't sweat, PS4 controller, my hands sweat. Why? It's disgusting. And I get annoyed. And there's no crossword because it's not Thursday. Or whatever day the crossword appears. I'm still not fully sure. Alright, um. Can't level up anyone. Can't level up Sojuro. Uh, I cannot level up Hifame. Um, you know what? I'm going to do billiards again. 
No, I can't change. I, I, I wanted to talk to you, but sadly I needed to go to work. We should talk later when I've got more time. Um, Welcome. that's something lol. Yeah, I'll take whatever I can get. That's because PlayStation is too hot to handle. What do you play? Sure. Um, should we do darts or billiards? We'll do billiards one more time. What do you want to do? Thank you. See if we can get the technical rank up one more time. Mm -hmm. Looks like we're all here. I'll be cheering on all of you. That's what you mean. Hmm. What a unique posture. 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 I hate that word so much. The winner balls are positioned. I'll need to make a difficult shot to clear it. Huh? A Q. Are you going to go for that shot? Nice. Nice. That was a perfect jump shot. Nailed you it. did it? What a show off. Voice acting. I knew you could do you it. actually pulled off that shot. That's why you're our leader. Looks like your challenge brought everyone together. Hey, the diddlers, level three. That was fun, Even if huh? you don't win, it's fun just to sink the balls into the pockets. Glad to see everyone had fun. I gotta say wow. now. Thanks for playing billiards. It looks like you've gotten better at analyzing situations. So I couldn't. I couldn't stay long. I have to go. I'm catching up. I'll try catching up your stream. Uh, no, it's fine, dude. You don't have to try and catch up. Just thank you for coming by. I appreciate it. I had so much fun. That was fun. Please uh, invite me next time too. Like I never want people to like feel like they have to force themselves to catch up or to watch. Like just watch when you can and you have time and just have fun. That's all. Yeah, uh, you know, that's all I want. Looks like you're trying to learn some technical shots. Let's see, I think you'd be able to pull it off. I think you'd be able to pull off a really advanced shot. It's called the Masse shot. It allows a ball to make a shot. Uh, oops. And suppose there's not much point in me explaining to it now explaining it now. Let me give you this book. I think it'll be quite useful to you. Masse shot, sir. If you're confident in your proficiency, maybe we should give it a try next time. Goodbye. Um, my, pr my proficiency is maxed out, so I can probably do it. Uh but yeah, see you later, RJ. Have a good night. What's that smell? Did you get a new perfume? It's nice. Yeah, it's a new full fragrant. It's supposed to be more serious like the Phantom Thieves. I thought I'd wear it to show my support while they're out taking down an evil corporation. A show of support, huh? I, a show, really? A show of support, huh? I could uh, post uh, a photo online of all the fan merch I've assembled. Maybe they'll be motivated by how passionate their fans are. Man, that's just rude, Cody. This is why Toby bullies you. And then he said ballies you. For some reason, I definitely can't talk today. Oh, I can level up uh, Maruki again. I mean, might as well. And a lot of Maruki time today. Welcome. Hmm. Oh, sounds great. Thank you. Thanks for coming. So today I'd like to start off with our usual topic. Not. I had to go in there, didn't I? I mean, I know you're going with a real treat today. I know it's been a while since you've had one too. Uh, I'm good in cookies, thanks. <laughs> Even I'm not that predictable. But so recently I found this delicious looking buffet. It's apparently well regarded and, and has all sorts of cuisines. Well, thanks for your input and making some real uh, progress in my paper. I'd like to take you to a buffet um, as my way of thanking you. How does that sound? Um, oh, really? Of course. Honestly, I feel like this won't even cover what I owe you after all you've done for me. Fuck you, you ass pirate. Ass pirate? Well, that settles it, then. Okay. We should head over go. now before I get too busy. Since when did I become an ass pi pirate? I'm more of a boob guy. Now. All right, now this is all on me today. No holding back. Please eat as much as you can. Self control, much? <laughs> Thanks for the food. Hmm. Dig in. Oh no, maybe I went a little overboard on my first trip. All right. Sorry. Would you mind if I ask you some about uh about about some before we eat? It's about my paper. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Sh Shib Shibawasa? 
is what the fuck is that name? She Shibu Swat Sawa. She she busses she busses Sawa. She busses Sawa. She busses Sawa. Is that it? Wow, the stream delay is crazy. I posted this at. All right, is it is it is the stream just being bad? When you read, look at the thing this time. I did. It's uh, thirty-one minutes past. Like I, I can see it. Maybe, maybe the delay is just for you. I don't know if the delay is for everyone. I have it on low latency, so it shouldn't be that bad. Um, judging for the fact that you haven't responded yet, I'm going to guess the delay is really big. Yeah, and the delay must be really big. Jesus. Huh? Maruki? Huh? I knew it! Shibu uh, Usa Sawa in the flesh. What are you doing here? That's my line. It's rare to see you in a restaurant like this one. Oh, and uh, who might this be? Oh, he uh, is, uh, how do I put it? I'm his pupil. People, are you teaching now or something? N not exactly. Anyway. This is Simeona. Nice to meet you. I'm Shibi Sh Shibu Asoa. Shibu Yushua is uh, one of my colleagues back in college. Uh, he's the one who recommended that I pursue a career in counseling. And I hear it's been doing you some good too. I guess wind of your uh, go goings on every so often. Honestly, it's a big relief. You have so much more compassion than most. But you can also be a bit too carefree. <sighs> no, you, know, you didn't have to mention that part. Not you know, that I can. That part, not that I can refute. I cannot read today. But anyway, tell me more about. Uh, tell me more about how you've been. Uh, how you've been. Fill me in. That's the text is confusing me now. But anyway, tell me how. Tell me more about how you've been. Fill me in on this guy too. Oh, uh, aren't you here with others? What about them? Ah, it's fine. We just happened to swing by the way. Uh, swing here. Swing by here. Why can't I read? They won't mind me being a bit late. And do you really think you two are going to be able to tackle all that food in your own? That's... Uh, right. Oh, so you're sitting at Shujin Academy, Simeona. There've been, there's been an awful lot of news uh, about that school this year. And that's where you're counselling too? Yeah, but only part-time. And what are you doing about a place like this? This isn't some kind of private counseling session, right? Well, he's been giving me a hand with my research. I just brought him here as a thank you for all his help. Research? I meant to mention this earlier, but my paper is almost finished. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, it's, uh, it's all thanks to you now. Paper? The one you were doing research for? You mean you're still... Yep, I'm still at it. Still at it. Even after all, all that went down. You remember what I told you? That I'd finish this paper no matter how long it took me? Okay. Ah, you blow my mind sometimes. I swear you got me no stubborn man in the world. Stubborn. Hmm. God damn it, I said stubborn. Stubborn man in the world! Is that supposed to be a compliment? But anyway, I'm not 100% complete yet. I still haven't begun the peer review process. But seriously? Oh, I'd be more than happy to review it for you. I mean, I did perform on the peer reviews for your publications in college. Uh, really? Of course, man. Why not? In fact, this this is it. This is now officially a celebration. The meal's on me today. I couldn't do that. I'm supposed to be treating Simeono. Oh, don't worry too much. Don't you want to congratulate him too, Simeono? Let's celebrate. See? He's up for it too. I, I appreciate it, but I do have to say I have mixed feelings about this. Oh, don't sweat the details. Come on, let's go for a second round. We've got to eat in the meat section, and the vegetables, and the beans. That was great. Uh, I'll try and read chat. Uh, maybe the chat just showing up is bad. I just saw the when you thing show up. The when you? What? Woo, what a feast. Something, something, something. Yeah, man, I'm going to get an earful for piling on the pounds. Huh? By who? My girl... Uh, well, my forgot to say to be more exact. Uh, I'm getting married soon. Ah, I see. Huh? What, wait, married? Yep, married. 
Now the now the only only one left from school is still flying solo. Sorry to pry, but I feel the need to ask, are you still Actually, forget I said anything. You're gonna ask me about Rumi, right? Don't worry, it's fine. Should I leave you two to talk? It's okay, and there's no need. Rumi was my girlfriend back when I was still a student. Well, uh... well, I was just C-spineless at the time and we broke up in the end. Hold on. It's, it's not like a tragedy or nothing, uh, no. It's like she's totally happy now. It's just, I don't feel ready to end another relationship of that sort right now. This is supposed to be a celebration that I've thoroughly killed the mood. Sorry about that. No, it's my bad for bringing it up in the first place. Why don't we wrap things up here? I have to say, it's really good to see you doing well, and with your paper must finish too. Hey Simeono, keep an eye on this guy for me, alright? I mean, it's pretty rare to see him open up to someone like he has with you. You talk about me like I'm some sullen kid. But I do feel I need to express my appreciation properly. Thank you. Thank you so much for helping someone like me make their dream come true, Simeono. It says Maruki's intense trust in me. Rank 8. Well, should we get going? Don't forget to send me that paper, okay? Hello, uh, sorry about that really hard cut, my OBS broke. I don't know why it started recently, but I've changed some settings. Hopefully, it works, but I'm gonna reinstall this when I'm finished, just to be safe. It means I have to redo all of my shit, but it's gotta be done. So, uh, I do apologize for all the hard cuts and whatnot that uh, we are experiencing. Okay. I decided to read the book about billiards. Oh. I didn't know billiards could be so exciting. The book even had a detailed explanation on photo and pictures on how to do masse shots. Uh, well, but we're trying to that we were trying to figure out, but we'll have to see if we can actually pull it off. Let's go play some time. Right. Gross. Hey, Cody. I've changed the encoder, so I'm hey hoping there. it won't crash. Good morning to you. Hmm. There are lots of students here at this hour. It's refreshing to make to see the work uh, commute, to make the work commute at a different time every now and then. You won't sleep? Well, of course not. I woke up on time. Or no, I am running late. On the way to work, I ran into these old ladies carrying some heavy luggage. Three of them, in fact. That I was offering to help carry their things, but then my back made this sound that it shouldn't make. I know. Oh, anyway, have you heard the news about Yoshizawa-san? <laughs> I'm so happy for her. It makes me feel like I'm doing. Uh, it makes me feel like doing my best too. Of course, as I say, I'm running late. But, hey, we need to switch it up every now and then. So let's do our best for today, shall we? Rank 8. I'm uh, one rank away. It's skipped breakfast and I'm hungry. Have you seen the totem pole at the diner in Shibuya yet? Yeah, it really is a totem pole. It's so colourful. I love, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably because of the way it looks. Yeah, I think you get, um... Courage for you in it. Rumi is nice. You'll see. Oh, so we get to meet Rumi. Oh, okay. have you heard? Have you heard? Uh, have you ever thought that your phone went off but nothing actually happened? It seems so many of us have experienced that, and then this is, that this term has been great for it. The English name in particular, in this particular phenomenon, is called is can be abbreviated to PVS. But anyone like to tell me what it stands for? I need an answer. This is Simiono. Let's hear it. What's the phenomenon uh, commonly called in English? Um. PVS. When referring to mistaken, you're thinking your phone is what? Um. Phone? No. Okay. Prediction. No. Okay. It's a phantom. Right, it starts with phantom since you're only imagining it. So the next part is vibration. That's it. Uh, so phantom vibration. It's either sounds of syndrome. This is it. Good. Good. The correct English term is phantom vibration syndrome. 
If you're anxiously waiting for someone to contact you, your brain will apparently trick you. This if this is an affliction that can only be uh, that can only affect a modern society where being connected 24/7 is commonplace. Bumi is one of the best additions in the game for on, for one line. Okay, it might not be too bad. Nice go. You're on a roll today. Well, I guess I'm looking forward to meeting Bumi then. They basically no chat delay now. Nice, I changed the encoder. Uh, when I was a student, I'd get all worked up, waiting for my SO to call me at night. Nowadays, people complain if you don't reply to a text, you just saw. Kind of obnoxious, if you ask me. Mm. Think we'll ever get to the point where we have to read each other's minds. I'll pass on that, thanks. Same. Mm -hmm. Akihabara was lots of fun. I think I want to try going there again sometime. It really sounds like Sojura wants me to go back to school. But online classes are better for studying. I could, wouldn't even have to leave the house. I wouldn't solve anything. Uh, you're probably right. Just studying by myself is actually different from actual school. School. Um... Be honest, I really do want to go back. Do you think I'll be able to? Uh, if we work together. Yes. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm going to do my best. Oh, I should make a promise list. My mom used to make me... They'd write on the goals for the month, like cleaning the house or running errands for her. And then when I'd finished one, she'd mark it off with a big stamp. She used to always write the best comments too. Those were the best. Oh, and once I finished my goals, she would take a day off work to spend time with me. All right. It decided I'm going to make a promise list. Time to get my ideas ready. Don't forget to go to the jazz club with... Food server on Sundays only. Okay. Here are my promises. One, go somewhere with lots of people. Getting used to the big crowds is key. Two, go to school. I want to see the inside of a normal high school. Three, learn about my generation. I definitely need more info. Four, have a normal conversation with a stranger my age. Hmm. How's that? Sounds good to me. I'm not setting a deadline for this, by the way. I want to try and finish them all someday. You're going to help me now. And I'll work even harder with my navigation and return. I am like super dehydrated. Ah. All right. Um. So, so um, if I could finish all the promises, you think I could have a ward? I know it's kind of weird, but like having a ward would wanting waiting it to finish would totally push me onward. All right. Anyway, I got this. No, I'm kind of exhausted from making the list. So tomorrow, I got this. Tomorrow. Yeah, rank two. I've only just started. I've only just started. Oi! Hoi! Hoi, it is I. Thanks for spending time with me today. Talking about our promise list brought back my moves when I used to work up with my mom. Hey, if we finish the promise list, if I finish the promise list and start going to school, do you think it makes Sojo happy? I bet it will. R right? No, and there's another reason I got to work at this. I wanted to think of something I could to do for Sojourer, but that's all I've got for now. First, I got to finish this promise list. Doing this alone would be like Omega hard, like trying to find a solo, trying to solo a final boss. But now that I got you in my party, I'm counting on you. Oh yeah, I'm stoked. Let's start Phantom Thieves Quest Four: Chapters of the Thieves. Sure, we've only got a party of tea, but we don't have to worry about that for now. Find it for now. Yeah. Back in baby rankage. I know, I just started, you bitch. Go to you fucking baby bitch. Ah, you're back. Things get really crazy online, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Uh, crossword time, crossword. Medicine of varying legality. Uh, cannabis? Oh no, there's no second eye. Hey, I really brain. No, keep trying. I press the wrong button. Not cannabis. Uh, poppy product. Uh, import illegally. Hmm. Would that be smuggle? A 
is a smuggle uh, poppy product. A poppy product. Um. Okay, let's giggle. Let's giggle what a poppy product is. Poppy product. Below are possible answers for the crossword clue poppy product. Opium. So opiums come from... I had no idea that opiums came from poppies. Okay, yeah, so that was thanks to crosswordstolver.org. Didn't even mean to do that. Okay, so we have a big... We have a big word. So a medicine with an O and an S. A medicine of varying legality with letters O and S. Uh, yeah, I figured that wouldn't be uh, precise enough to find a answer. Um... Legal terms for illegal drugs. Oh, narcotics. Narcotics. There we go. Narcotics. A uh, great thing to have in your search history. Oh, shit. <laughs> You've got a point there. Hey, right. the term applies to any medicine that dulls the senses, but is more of more often used as a generic term for both legal and illegal drugs being misused. Morphine, a common narcotic used as a painkiller in many med medical facilities, is named after the Morpheus. Is named after Morpheus, the Greek god of sleep. All right. Nice. Oh wow, even I couldn't figure that one out. Nice. So, how many crosswords are there? Because I'm on number 13, and I'm halfway through the game. Like, well, more than halfway through the game. Like, have I got enough time to finish all of them? Like, how many are there? <sighs> when is President Ok- uh, Okuruma gonna get down and beg for forgiveness? The sooner they get it done, the better it's for society. We can't leave fighting the thieves and let us down. These, poli these politicians in Okuruma both deserve divine punishment. And this place sort out. This place is sort out of Phantom First. No, it it was for Persona Five Royal. All right. When I went to buy a present for my grandchild the other day, and they had a Phantom Thieves costume on sale. It'd spell the end for the end. It would spell the end of the country if kids started wanting to become more like the Phantom Thieves. You already went through your second year of high school. You're already in your second year of high school. You should have a clear vision of your future. If you're looking for safety and stability, a civil servant is a good idea. A hey, Simeono. Why don't you try? I bet on the, I bet you all think the civil service is all office work, but the fishermen of Nagaragawa are actually civil servants as well. To tell me what sector they belong to, I don't know. The Imperial Household Agency. I mean, that was true. This is it. Very good. Oh, I'm impressed you knew that. Only the conformant fishermen of Nagos Nagaragawa uh, are officially used by the Imperial Household. Those fishermen are granted spots on the Imperial Household Agency's board and Semeromi's. Semeromi. Semeromi. You know, I know what voice fits this guy best. <laughs> Whoa, how did he get that question? Well, did he get that question? I wasn't even close. 
B is actually kind of smart. I'm kind of surprised. Oh shoot, the teacher's glaring at us. Nice. They must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. Oh yeah, it said on the news that the cabinet's approval went, rate went down again. Then the complete opposite of us. Our popular and approval keeps going through the roof. Perfect impression, exactly. Professional voice actor. Hey. Alright. Where can we go? Can level up Baruki, can level up Futaba, and that's about it. Um. Yeah, we'll do Maruki. Welcome. Thank you. Oh yeah. The music in this game is so good. Thank you. Thanks for coming. You see. There's actually something I want to talk to you about. I know this is a little personal, but you remember how my former girlfriend came up the other day, Rumi? Yeah. Well, we were engaged, if you can believe that. She was so cheerful. I mean, she could get pretty aggressive. She was always kind of hot-headed, but always so kind too. She was the best thing that ever happened to me. I didn't deserve her, but if we had our shot, my life would have been so much happier than, than it had ever been. But reality's never that simple. A burglar broke into her family's home. Rumi and I had been visiting. We were there to see what he'd done to them. It was just bad luck. But it didn't end there. He must have been desperate to escape. He attacked Rumi on his way out. I was right there with her, and I couldn't do anything. Pathetic, right? We were lucky Rumi's uh, injuries weren't more severe. The physical ones, at least. But the shock in the incident was too much. She had a mental breakdown. We talked about that, didn't we? Our wounds in the hearts aren't the same straightforward, aren't as straightforward as physical ones. She never really recovered from what happened, even after all this time. I guess I kind of lost myself in that pain for a while too. Why? You didn't deserve that. None of them did. None of them did anything wrong. I... Sorry. I'm sorry. When I saw it in the hospital bed, I made a vow. I swore never to. I swore I'd do all I could to fight back against the unfairness of reality. If someone suffered like that, I'd help. Like I said before, Rumi's in a better mental place now. She's happy. But that pain I felt back then, that's how, the pro that's how this project was born. Born? Born. And thanks to you, I finally found my true goal in that research too. I didn't care how long it takes took me. I don't care how long it takes me. I will make my dream come true. <laughs> for Rumi's sake, of course, but for you too, Simeona. I... Honestly, don't have the words to, to say what all this means to me, but I can at least say this. Thank you so much for everything. Thank you. I found my answer. And once it's ready, I hope you'll let me use it to find the happiness you deserve. The path is clear now. I think this will probably be the last time I come to you about this paper. Kind of sad. I know how you feel. It, means, it meant a lot to me too. I'll let you know when I finally finish that paper. When I do, I'll have to thank you one last time. You helped me see my dream through. I owe you so much. No. But for now, I should uphold my end of the deal. I think I've got a real special one for you today. I think you're going to go ready for something on another level now. I can sense a strong bond with my friendship with Maruki. My nose is really itchy as well. I hate when I get an itchy nose because it always looks like I'm picking my fucking nose and like I'm not fucking itchy. Scratchy. Ow, all right. Yeah. And there's one more thing I want to tell you, but I'll save it until after I finish the paper. I just hope you can forgive me for it. Uh oh. Uh, uh, don't sorry. mind me. Sorry, that came out way too ominous. The uh, dodgy. Nice picker. Thanks. Thanks, Maruki's mental training. My mind feels stronger. All right. Well, see you. So he's hiding something then, definitely, isn't he? But I guess we'll find out when we get to rank 10. Ah, you're back. Hey, still can't hang out with a catchy. I could level up. Oh, her name's Oya. I've been calling her Chia this entire time. It's Oya. How did I forget it was Oya? I feel stupid. 
Okay. Um. No, oh, I can level up. Oh, you know what? No, fuck it. I'm gonna level up Sodra. Ah, uh, thanks. No, it's fine. I, I walked into that one. Have you? Do you ever get lonely, Sochan? You've been a bachelor for so long. Have you given up on marriage? <laughs> All I want in this relationship is spicy simulation followed by some smooth, relaxing comfort. And I can get both of those things from my curry and my coffee. That's enough for me. He always dodges my questions like that. He's so clever. By the way, what are your thoughts on Sochan's life of solitude? I admire it. You can admire it all you want, but I don't recommend trying to follow my first steps. Anyway, the only thing I care about in this life is making sure my customers are satisfied. Nothing makes me more happy. Nothing makes me happier than seeing people relax in here. Coming back, come back anytime, okay? Anytime. Hey. Back an accent, right? She seemed especially aggressive today, huh? It would have been bad if she pushed any further. But I guess food service, re 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 food service relies on keeping people the right distance away. No, too far, not too close. Well, you just don't know when to give up, do you? Well, I just learned something very interesting. Victoria's been shut off from both school and society the whole time, huh? Not in very good parenting. Yeah, and what do you, what have you done for her? Well, you know very well what I've done, and it's about time to pay up. Don't be ridiculous. Victoria's had a terrible life living with you. Plus, I've already gave him most of the inheritance for custody. Is that not enough for you? Oh, we could find more ways. We could always find that in court. I wonder who would win between a blood relative and a mere legal guardian. You. Oh, and not to mention this kid you have here. I've heard all about him and his criminal record. This leaves me. That leaves us. That leaves us with a parent who won't let her go to school and a delinquent housemate on probation. Doesn't seem quite the best environment for Tibar for, for Tibarva now, does it? I keep fucking up the names. You're wrong. What was that? It's fine. I'll take it. I'll take care of this. Just go upstairs. Dojo, I'm hunger. I hunger. I'm hunger. Oh. Who double chat? No, it's a long time no see. I, I, I. Utaba. See what I'm saying? She's a total wreck. Clearly, this is not a healthy situation. She's only like this because she saw you here. Hmm, don't let me repeat myself. You can't beat me in court, so you might as well just give me the money. Ugh. Well, I hope you reach the right decision. Bye now. So, I've become hunger itself. I know. Butaba, you should just head home for today. I'll take you. Sojuro. My voice is dying from this. <sighs> Butaba's okay. All that drama was tired her, tired her out. She fell asleep right after we got home. That man is Futaba's uncle. After Waka died, Futaba passed around, was passed around by all the relatives. His place was the last. He treated her like garbage. He never fed him, forced her to sleep on the floor like an animal. He didn't even like, bathe. Once I learned that, I knew I had to step in. I couldn't stand for that kind of horrible treatment. I decided to take Futaba under my care. Even back then, he was whining about all the damn expenses. I even threw some cash his way, thinking he would put the issue to bed. And now he's back for more. I don't even know how he managed to find me here. Maybe paying him was a mistake. Saving Futaba was no mistake. <sighs> Thanks. Never thought you'd been the one comforting me. Either way. Either way, no. It's my fault Futaba didn't leave the room. I just didn't know how to make her leave now. I didn't know how to make her. I didn't know how to help her through it now. I'd make a curry, leave it by a door, and go. Fuck. If not for you, I'd probably still be waiting out for her to come out. Still, if she asked me whether I deserve to be Futaba's guardian, my answer would be no. They still say blood's thicker than water, right? I wonder what would be best for Futaba. Sorry. Uh, look at me spilling my heart to a punk like you. No, it's kind of weird. For some reason, I just feel like I can tell you this kind of stuff. It's kind of like appearing into my heart. There's just something special about you. But like, if you does, so Jero's bond is growing deeper. My voice is dying from this. It's, he's got such right. a deep voice, and my voice isn't that deep. It's pretty late. 
I'm going home. I'm gonna. I'm. I should be heading home. I'm still worried about Futaba. Don't stay up too late. You hear? Oh, and uh, thanks. I oh, like the compassion hidden behind Sodro's actions. I can see the compassion behind Sodro's actions. I feel my kindness is growing. I really just cannot speak. <sighs> hey. Futaba's fast asleep. Didn't mean to make you all get all tangled in this mess. If I can help somehow. No, you don't have to do anything. The fact that you asked is enough. Ah, uh, man, no. I don't ever know. I don't... I never know what I'm getting into when I talk to you. I just keep yammering on about stuff I never plan on talking about. Must be getting senile, huh? Anyway, don't worry about that guy. I'll find some way to deal with him. You just keep looking out for Vitaba. Seems like you two are really hitting it off, so... That's what I have to say. Don't forget to lock up before bed. Later. My hand is getting numb. I don't know why. <sighs> Morning. Hey, you coming up with on the you keeping up with on the comments online? There's a lot of hate for Akamuma and there's a lot of expectations for us. Papa Haru's dad has had a change of heart soon too. Uh they have high hopes for us. I know, ain't it awesome? There's gonna be a huge uproar this time. As usual, it'll be a while before we get to see some results, but man, I'm looking so forward to this. I keep re I keep putting the words the wrong way around. I don't know why. I feel like the more, the more I do this voice stuff, the more fumbly I get. Anyway, we're gonna call it there. I'm going to eat some dinner. You might eat some dinner. I mean, cook for 40 minutes. Regret the fact that I didn't start cooking earlier, and then eat. So thank you. I'll be back later. See you later, Cody. See you later, everyone. Goodbye.